drafted in 1993. My second year ended up getting cut in training camp. I made a vow to myself, man, I never get cut again because I didn't work hard enough. What a story this is. I'm not a receiver, I'm a football player. I just want to be on the field in any capacity. Troy Brown, he's just got such a knack for this game. The AFC Championship game that year was no different. The kick is blocked! You get a chance to make a play, make it. From Heinz Field in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, it's the American Football Conference Championship game between the New England Patriots and the big bad Pittsburgh Steelers. It can be a little bit intimidating when you walk out there in Pittsburgh. They're waving the terrible towels. It was a pretty intense game. Patriots want it. We're going to get it to them today. You best believe that. You know, guys coming into each other's warm ups, talking smack, you know, kicking balls off the tees of the kickers when they're trying to warm up. During the week, Belichick actually showed us a tape of Bill Cowher. He gave them the day off so they could get their families' plane tickets and hotel reservations to go to New Orleans. And basically, they were overlooking us. And we were underdogs. But being an underdog makes it easy to have a chip on your shoulder to go out there and win. 3.58 to go in the first quarter of a scoreless game. Troy Brown stands inside his 45. Pittsburgh, they were punting from their left hash originally. And what happened was they had their gunner who ran out of bounds. Number 81 went out of bounds. So they dropped the flag on him. But the referee, he spotted the ball on their right hash. And therefore, he had to try to kick the ball out of bounds to his left again. Miller punting right to left, handles the snap. Well, it didn't work out that well. Down the middle. Troy Brown from the 45. They give all the options to Troy Brown. The ball came down right in the middle of the field. There was no hang time on it. And I got a chance to get my head down. And when I saw my opportunity, I just hit the gas. To the 35, to the 30, 25, 15, 10, 5. He's in. Touchdown. Touchdown. Touchdown, Troy Brown. The first time was on the left pass. The second time was on the right pass. When they put this, you were wrong. What you have was wrong. Patriot quarterback is down. When Tom got hurt, all we know is he was limping off the field. Drew Bledsoe will come in for the first time since the second week of the season. Tom Brady came in for Drew Bledsoe early in the season. And after Tom Brady went out in Pittsburgh, Drew Bledsoe came in and finished up the AFC Championship game. Everybody was so excited for Drew. Touchdown! Touchdown by Drew Bledsoe! His first touchdown pass of the season! Couldn't hold a script better than that. Chris Brown and the field goal unit on it. Here in New England, I think that was one of the first teams where you see a lot of starters that play special teams. 34-yard field goal attempt for Chris Brown, Miller to hold. So I come up the field about two or three steps. We'll snap the ball down, the kick is blocked! The kick was blocked! And I just hear a loud thumping noise. The earlier. That was blocked. And then I see the ball flying back, so I'm thinking I gotta run the kick. My whole mindset is I gotta scoop it and score. Well, I scooped it. It's going to be picked up by Troy Brown. My instincts was Antoine Harris is probably about two yards behind me, maybe. So I gave him the rock, man. <laughs> He's across the 50. He's lateral the top. And he gets on the sideline, Antoine Harris. And he goes all the way for a touchdown. Antoine Harris on the lateral from Troy Brown. And the crowd in Pittsburgh is stunned. What a play by Troy Brown. The give to the bus, and he drives to the goal line, and there the touchdown, is. Pittsburgh! It makes this a football game. Well, you can't have any doubt, because our offense has started to spur the two. Boy, what did we say just a moment ago about a shift in momentum? The give to Amos. He cuts it back to the left, and he's into the end zone. A touch for the Steelers' touchdown. We've got a football game. Whoa, Nelly! Pittsburgh was finding a rhythm. We got to get things back in our favor. There was one play in the fourth quarter. I had to come all the way across the field <laughs> to get in Drew's line of sight. Bledsoe back to throw. Stands in there, throws it to the right. He just kind of lobbed it up in the air to help keep that drive alive and keep Pittsburgh off the field. It is caught by Troy Brown. First down. The 50-yard field goal attempt to try to put it out of reach. 
Here's the snap. The ball is down. Vinatieri's kick is on its way. That kick has elevation. It's no good. It's no good. So the Steelers have some life. Being here in New England, you have to develop a mental toughness. You got to shake it off and go out and compete every single play. So Pittsburgh takes over. They're only 60 yards away from a tying touchdown. Stewart to looks, fires down the field. You kind of see the ball going a little bit high. It's hitting Lloyd Malloy right in the chest. Could be picked it is. It's intercepted. Picked off by the Patriots. At that point, you already know guys are just rubbing it in and telling them to return those plane tickets and get refunds. And Bill Belichick's New England Patriots are going to the Super Bowl. All I tried to do was go out there and do the right thing. That's the Patriot way. What can I do for my football team to help us be successful? To be a legend, you got to perform in some unusual ways. I think you are the embodiment of what this team represents. The underdog, the underrated guy. If you're a legend, I think those stories transcend on their own. We just did the unthinkable. Came into Pittsburgh, young and experienced football team. Came up with the big win. I think that led to our dominance for a very long time. <laughs>